What is up everyone? It is me, Wyatt the Scarecrow here, and today I am at another Spirit Halloween. This one is located in Aurora, Ohio. This is kind of an unexpected video as I was not expecting to go to this one today. Um, but we are here, so let's go ahead and check it out. I was also at this one last year, so let's see what is going on. So right here we have the archway. First things first, I am greeted with Con Candy Dan and Ghostface. But first things first, let's go ahead and activate Con Candy Dan. Get your cotton candy here! We've added some new ingredients! So, yeah, there he is. Over here we have Ghostface, which I am actually returning today because if you guys haven't heard, mine actually fried. So now I have to return mine, but here he is though. They have him with the bloody mask and with the machete. But here he is. Now going through the Karn Evil. Right here we have Towering Tallulah set up, but seems that she is not on as they just have her already risen up. But there is a footpad over there. Um, but I'm not gonna activate her just yet. Actually, you know what? I might as well just try. Um, yeah, so it looks like she is broken. She has already popped up. But I was all right though. They have the posters over here. Over here, before we get to the Down the Duck, right here they have Giant Death Ray, looking cool as usual. Get a close up of his face. He is super wicked in person. Let's go ahead and try him out. Yeah, in person, his lighting effect is awesome. Servos in his head. Very, very cool. See right there, he is retailing for $349.99, so $350. But there he is. I would have my tripod, but again, since this um, video is kind of unexpected, I wasn't able to get it. But right here, this is where Max Straw would be set up, but they do not have them. Over here for Down the Duck, they do not have Cremator or Art the Clown, but they do have a Nibbles the Clown set up. So let's go ahead and activate them. It's a little loud over here. Let's play a game. <laughs> if you win, you get a prize. Yeah, there he if is. And this is where Cremator would go, but he's not here. Don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah. The Nibbles motion tracking is insane. Alright, then over here they have the sitting scarecrow set up. Let's get him going. So there he is. And over here, this is super cool. Right here, we have Bobby Strings in box for sale. And his box is freaking huge. Like, it is a huge box. And then over here, this is my first time seeing this. They have a demonic gatekeeper. They have two man's possessed friends. They have an, a Regan from the Exorcist. They have four black and red jumping spiders. They have a bunch of the black jumping spiders. They actually also have a Nibbles in stock. Two Grave Watchers. Three Howling Spirits, a bunch of the Sitting Scarecrows and the Scaring Scarecrows. They have a Barnaby the Bear. They have three Greystone Ghouls. They have a Giant Death Ray, three Static Ghost Faces, and they have another Deluxe Ghost Face. Um, so that's cool. They have two Emilies, and they have a Night Terror and a Mr. Punchy. So that's pretty cool. Make my way over here to the other side of the store where they have kind of the back theme over here. Right here they have the Fun House. And since this is a smaller store, they're not going to have any of the other props set up, but it's all right. Dang, Barnaby just scared me. Right here, they have Bobby Strings. Get him going. Oh, yeah, there he is. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, Bobby Strings has kind of grown on me a lot because he was super big. Now, over here they got Emily, but before I activate her, um, if you guys remember in the other store tour, uh, they had Barnaby set up, but he was not working, but here he is. First time seeing him in action. And he is appearing to be on center. Yeah, there is Barnaby. Right over here they have the gray jumping spider. So let's go ahead and get him going. There he is. Over here they got Emily. No victor yet, but that's all right. That was a bride. I 
Again, no, Victor set up right here. There is this clown, which just keeps shaking his head. He's pretty cool too. I just really like this year's theme in general. Again. Now, <laughs> funny thing is the last store tour, I forgot to go in the fun house of terror. So this is my first time walking in it for the first time. Wow, okay. And it actually does smell like cotton candy in here, which is insane. Here is the projection right here. Jack the Reaper. Yeah, yeah, this is super cool in person. It's really big. But yeah, there he is. There's me, by the way. There is Silent and Deadly. So there he is. And watch, he's actually gonna create a smiley face, which was actually in the teaser that Spirit posted like back in April. So it actually makes sense. But yeah, it, it literally smells like cotton candy in here, which is insane. Oh, there's poor George. Obviously a prop from last year. I also own him. Yeah, there he is. And then over here, we got the mirrors. Uh, they're kind of doing, <laughs> they're doing me dirty right here. All right, but that was the Flint House of Terror, so that was pretty cool. I just don't know how I forgot to go in it the last time. Um, but over here, when we make our way over here, we got the inflatables. Kind of just the same thing that you would see. We got the Reapers, got a snake, a ghost, a cat, a wolf. They have this scarecrow archway, which is super cool. Really like this. They have the 12 foot ghost face, the gargoyle, the jack-o'-lantern archway, more snakes, another scarecrow, another ghost face, and basically just the same things. Over here, we got the skeleton section. Trying to get a good look. There it is, just classic skeletons and everything. We got the hanging stuff over here. Got this ghost guy. But then we got Sam who just wants to square up with me. All right, and then we got the hanging clown. This is everything else. I don't notice anything new. Over here we have tombstones. We have the um, never to return tombstone. So that's pretty cool. Most of the other tombstones. We have the stuffed dummy prop, the foam coffin, which I find interesting. Zombie Baby's Cradle, um, a battery adapter. They have two of those. I was actually thinking about getting this and then we got the swing mechanism, go swing, which I got last year at flagship. The animatronic activation switch from last year, step pad cover, and then the step pads. And then there's that. Over here, we got some more tombstones, some bigger ones, some fencing, some lights. Then over here, they actually have the gray jumping spider. Already got him. And then we got just some fog machines, some other lights. What is this? Mini strobe. So it's a small strobe light. Um, nothing new over here. They got some lawn stakes right here, some zombie hands. Over here, we have some light covers. We have the clown, which is pretty cool, and the skull. Yeah, these are pretty cool, actually. I thought they were like, mm, okay, when they first got leaked, but these are actually somewhat cool. Over here, we have these scary flying ghosts. A bunch of them in stock, jumping spider. I almost said jumping spider, dropping spider. Um, some of the dolls, we have Pestilence Pete, Monkey Chimes, what's behind here, Loving Lilith, another Monkey Chimes, Iria Emma, Devilish Desmond, and The Butcher. He looks kind of different for some reason, I don't know why. Yeah, but that's it for over here. Let's go ahead and check out the masks. See what's going on over here. This metallic pumpkin looks pretty cool. There's that. I'm trying to see if there's any new masks. Some I haven't looked at before. I'm trying to look. Oh, right here they have the Halloween 2 mask. Pretty cool. I am looking for one mask though. Um, got the crouchy mask with the gloves. Um, oh, it's over here. So this is what I was about to say. The Art the Clown masks right here. They got the bloody one and the clean one. Yeah, very interesting in person. Yeah, there it is. Mars Attacks, got some Star Wars. Uh, Jason Voorhees, uh, a God mask from The Purge. Not really big on The Purge, if I'm gonna be honest. Um, got the Scarecrow in a motion mask. This thing is sick, but I just have bad luck with it as I ended up owning four of those because they kept breaking. 
that's all right though. We got some pumpkin, UV pumpkin, possessed pumpkin, and then we got this half mask. This thing's pretty big. It's pretty cool. But yeah, that's basically it for the masks. Um, trying to see what else is there I could look at. I want to check out the ghost face section over here. Um, we got some ghost face stuff right here. I know there is a whole section. I actually found that it's over here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And ooh, this is new. I haven't seen this. A bloody um, Terrifier knife. It says Terrifier right there. It has Art the Clown. It's double-sided. So one side's clean, one side is bloody. So, um, can't get it up there. There we go. It's pretty cool. And over here, they have the ghost face stuff. So right here, they have the um, what's up mask, the uh, ghost face knife, you have a machete. Right here, we have an aged ghost face. This one actually is kind of a good form. It's kind of tiny though. And then we have a light up ghost face mask, devil face, ghost face up there. And over here, they do have the bling ghost face. That's the costume. Oh, and they also have the Slayer kit right here. I heard that there also is a Bling Slayer kit this year, which is pretty cool. Uh, man, what else could I look at? I know we just saw a Michael Myers mask, but I do not see a section for it. Right here, they have the uh, shirts. This is pretty cool. Uh, last year, I was planning on getting the Sam shirt, like the spirit shirt, but it had Sam. Um, so yeah, obviously they don't have it anymore, but the, that one right there is probably sold out. Yeah, it's nowhere to be found. But yeah, <laughs> sorry about the music if it's a little loud. Yeah, here it is. The whole Karn Evil, trying to get a good look. But yeah, since this is a smaller store, it's a little bit different. Sorry if I sound kind of exhausted. That is because, um, earlier before I came here... Um, I was helping my dad put up a door and I also got stung on the foot because I am wearing Crocs right now. So I sound a little miserable. I apologize about that. Um, I don't know what else to look at. I'm trying to see if there is anything I missed. Well, I might as well just go over here just to see. Got some Makira clown masks and costumes. Got the Ringmaster, Sinister Ringmaster, Creepy Towering Clown, two Crouchies, actually, yeah. Um, Carver the Clown, pretty cool. Um, and then this Mime, that's pretty cool. It's also up there as well. Got some masks, a Vintage Clown, Jester, and then a Scary Clown. Some of the female costumes, some of the hats right here. Just feel really nice, like high quality. Some baseball bats and they actually do have the Crouchy baseball bat. Interesting. I'm still planning on getting that. I'll probably get it at a different store though. A machete. Kind of feels f familiar to uh, Ghostface's machete. Sludge hammer. Pretty cool. A bloody knife. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, there is all of that. Um, I'll see if there's anything else I can look at, but real quick, here are the zombie stuff. Pretty cool. I like the gauze hanging from this. This is a pretty gory mask. I was thinking about getting this last year and making a prop out of it, but I'm not thinking about it anymore, but this is still a cool zombie mask. And then right here, we just have this other one right here. Feels kind of weird. Now, I do want to swing by over here just to see if they have... Um, right here, actually, they have the Jack the Reaper costume. I already have that. Got that last year. But I am just surprised. They do not have the Nightcrawler costume in adult size. Not that I know of. Green jumpsuit. Got some basic stuff over here. This machete. Got a knife. Hockey masks. What's underneath this? It's this unholy mask. Yeah, I am just so surprised. They do not have the Nightcrawler costume in adult size. Surprisingly enough, I forgot to mention, there's actually not a lot of people in here, so it's kind of quiet. But that is alright, though. I'm actually going to make my way over here, because I believe I missed something. I want to check out the horror babies right here. 
So here they are. They have the, um, what's this, devil cherub? Doesn't work. Got the other one though. Over here, they do have the Michael Myers Horror Baby. I did skip this. There he is though. And he is $49.99, so 50 USD. Some of the Haunted Mansion stuff. Got the door knocker. guys with the audio no feet Let's see what else is there to look at so strange looking spider it's kind of heavy actually it's a heavy spider it's got to come over here oh here are the side steppers got the michael myers then over here they got another one so i can make both of them because why not but yeah there he is now the one issue i had with mine is that the knife was kind of bent but i'm gonna have to do something to make sure it's like straight because it's kind of bent like this one right here Ghostface, obviously he's one from last year chucky not a big fan of this one he's all right though it's not on yeah but there he is though she's not really fond of it right here they have the ghost face um wreath which does light up this thing is 39.99 oh and it just lights up right there all right yeah, I mean, this is all right. It's all right. Nothing too crazy. Got some canvases right here. Mostly down here. We have a good old friend tombstone right here. Beal juice. Jack the Reaper's up there. We have a hanging zero, actually. Yeah, I don't know what else there is to look at. And, oh boy. Oh boy. Um, oh God. Okay, that's that's not good. As you probably just saw, I'm not a big fan of Digital Circus. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, here is the back of this poster. If you want to scan any of these, probably can't in this video. But any of the props that stores do not have, you can just scan these and see them in action on the website. I am looking for Dark Princess. I'm thinking about Demonic Gatekeeper. I'm probably not going to get him today but I eventually do want to get him. Um, I don't know what's going on with Cremator here. This could be the prototype, but I don't know. He's looking a little weird. Um, yeah, there is everything. Pretty cool. And you know what? Since I am here, I might just get a poster. As you can see, there's Monty's. There's Fright in the Box. I'm looking for a young Crouchy, but I don't think they have one here. But it is all right though. That is alrighty. Um. Oh, I forgot to spin the wheel. Silly me, I forgot to spin the wheel. What am I doing? <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and spin the wheel since I forgot to do it. Can't believe I forgot to spin this. Oh, um, looks like I got the moon again. Cause that's what landed. Actually, you know what? I'm spinning it again. That wasn't a fair spin see what I get this time oh I got death I died silly me I forgot to film an outro for this video so I did not buy anything at this spirit Halloween because I was just returning Ghostface, and that was basically it um, I kind of want to hurry this up because I am going somewhere but I am sorry I did not film an outro for this um, but I'm just kind of doing a little voiceover well I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching until then I'll see you guys in the next video Peace out.